There is no peace for a child of Baal. You've learned this lesson time and again, as all who are close to you suffer because of your tainted blood. When John Irenicus fell, you had hoped for some sort of respite. But peril follows you like pestilence. The time of the prophecy has come. Five powerful ball spawn have arisen, leading their armies across the sword coast, slaughtering their weaker siblings and innocents alike in a wave of massive destruction. Like wildfire, panic spreads before the armies of the Five, and those suspected of being children of Baal are cast out and revived. Even in Soldanesalar, unease grows into fear at your presence. Queen Elysim urges you to visit a sacred grove where the ancients might shed light on your fate. You wonder what part you will play in the dreaded prophecy how long before its culmination devours your soul. Only one thing seems certain. So long as Baal's throne of blood stands empty, chaos shall reign. What is my task? It shall be. I am at peace in the outdoor places, even though it's never so It was an effort to track you down in these woods. Too many old wards for my liking. But here you are. All that you need to know is that I have been given the pleasure of ending your life. I may yet mount your head on the wall with all the other ball spawn I've killed. I haven't decided. Not all of us have been wandering Faroon like witless cattle, like you and pathetic Amoen and so many others of Baal's blood. Some of us have far greater aspirations. The time of Alondo's prophecy has come. These rhyming ghosts here should have told you that much. Great things are afoot, and your contribution will be your death. It has already been decided. I am Illa Sarah the Queen. Child of Baal, 
And I have been chosen to perform this deed. You cannot resist us. We shall see. This is a lot more exciting than any circus. I await your move. Divine blood. I have awaited you. How would you define a dream? It has a fleeting path without true substance. And this is no dream. I have brought you to this place. And it is real. I have existed since the first strand of fate was woven. A servant of the paths and the gods. I have watched your own path most carefully. Our own servant, who was the mortal alarmed of you, spake the truth that became prophecy. It tells of your coming from all the others who are the progeny of all. The spark of the divine rests within all of God's children, and the time for their joy is nigh. I am here to aid you, God child. I cannot I can only prepare you, my child. Aid in your education. You who are most unready to serve your destiny. I mean only that you are unready for the possibilities that I need you. Your mortal mind does not readily comprehend the power of your blood. When you were last in your sire's realm, God child, it was altered by your own consciousness without you even forming the intent to do so. You are not ready for the power. You must be ready. It is your presence which determines the outcome of the prophecy. Although even I cannot see it yet. When the time comes, you will be ready. I will make certain. Power comes with knowledge, Godchild. It shall come to you in time, as your destiny unfolds. I shall see you soon. Until then, hold your heart close and know that you are not alone. So, you have finally arrived. I have been waiting.